Good morning, my friends. Um, I just wanted to thank you, thank you all from the bottom of my heart for everyone that did a video for me, for all of the comments. Oh my God, y'all just had me just in boohoo land. I just, I'm just so overwhelmed with everything. Um, I also wanted to thank all my new subscribers and um, this has been a journey for me and you know we have to make it our journey we can't make it somebody else's journey um, if we're on this road we're on this road for ourselves um, I just made a video on the road uh, yesterday I was with we were out and about and Sally wanted me to make a video on motivation and uh, I got to really thinking about motivation and uh, everything I said in the video is so true but I didn't say this what really really deep down inside in my heart motivates me It's fear. Fear. Why do I say fear? I say fear because I don't want to go back. I don't want to go back to a body that wasn't functionable. And we all know what we're talking about, what I'm talking about. For those that say, um, I'm living life, you're living life. You sure are. I'm living life. I'm proof that it can happen. But sometimes people are in a body that all they can do is dream and they can't come out of it and they can't get motivated I'm talking to those people I'm looking into this camera and I want to tell you fight for that motivation if you're, un if you're unable to do walking I didn't want to walk in the street. I didn't want to walk in public. I did it in my house. And I did it for 10 minutes every day, three times a day. We want miracles. We want it to happen overnight. My husband always says, you didn't get like that overnight. It's not going to come off overnight. But I did a little bit at a time. I cut back on my food. I started doing protein shakes in the morning. And that helped me tremendously. So I don't want to make this video long. I'm, I got emotional this morning and I got to thinking of where, I, where I've come from, where I've come. And it's, it has been a journey and it's not over and it'll never be over. Like my sister always says, it's never going to be over, Connie. You'll be on this journey for a while. So, I just want to thank you all, like I said, for my comments. And for those that are struggling, know that I know where you're coming from. And I'm still, I'm still dealing with the same things. But I'm able to move so much better. I have the movements. Oh, my God. I can't even. That's why I get so emotional. And my words just don't want to come out like I would like for them to. I wish I was like Rosemary where she has words. I love to listen to my sister. She's so knowledgeable. And so many that are out there. I mean, I love watching y'all's videos. Uh, but know in my heart, for those that are so are struggling with y'all's everyday routine that you're not able to do, do a little bit of something. Do a little bit of something. Motivate yourself to do something. Even if it's in the chair. And you just you can only just do your legs up and down. Do that. My husband has me on that uh, ball over there. Uh, 
I don't know if you can see it, but it's uh, the big blue ball. While I'm watching TV, guess what I'm doing? I'm bouncing on it like this. <laughs> and it's working my waist. It's working my legs, the upper part of my legs. And so it's something. So I know I'm making this way too long, but I've had a morning like you would not believe. And I just wanted to add that on to the motivation. Thank you all. God bless. We will see you when we see you. Bye. Hello, everyone. Hey, hello, everybody. Hello. <laughs> hello. I'm wondering when you're going to say hello. Oh, well, Sally wanted me to do a what motivates me daily. Well, all of y'all motivate me. I see so much motivation out there, but... I always say, and I've always said, motivation comes within. You know, I thank God uh, for my husband. You know, we get up in the morning, we do what we usually do, and when 5 o'clock gets around and it's getting close to, to the pool, I don't, he doesn't say, are you, you know, are you getting ready or are you ready? He knows I'm supposed to be getting ready. So, that's my motivation because I know I got to go. <laughs> and if I'm not feeling all of that, um, somehow something happens and I get out there and then I'm out there and I wonder, oh, I was feeling, I wasn't feeling all that, but now that I came out here and afterwards, I feel pretty good. So, sometimes when we kind of feel like we don't want to go, just go. And you'd be surprised after the workout, you feel amazing. And you wonder, why was I feeling that way from the get-go, you know? It could be it's hot, maybe in your house, and it's you just don't feel like it. You just, you never know. Well, what is that mind over, what is it, mind over power or power? Matter. Matter? Mind over matter? <laughs> mind over matter, mom. Okay, whatever. So sometimes we just have to reach inside and go for it. So um, I get my motivation, like I said, from all of y'all. I get my motivation from within, from my family. Um, there's just so much uh, that I, I just dig deep inside. It's not as bad as it was when I first started. It was very hard for me, very hard, because, you see, I had to get up early in the morning, and I had to get my stomach to do what it had to do, and before I could even walk out the door, you know what I'm talking about. So, um, all of that, you know, and I did it twice, I mean, I went to the pool twice a day. So, I was at that gym twice a day for a long time. And so even now, sometimes, you know, we decide to go in the mornings, we'll go in the afternoon too because I don't want to miss out on a good workout in the pool because it's been amazing lately. We have got some new uh, trainers out there that are working us in the pool and everyone is so different now. Oh my God, it's like one works out your arms, one works out your waist. The other one works out your legs because uh, they, they do a lot of repetition over and I mean one has us running like crazy and the other one has us jumping and then it's just back and forth twisting. Like if you saw my video when my daughter went, uh -huh, she found out how hard her mama works in the pool. So anyway, I did this for Miss Sally so that's where I get my motivation. From watching YouTube, watching, see how hard y'all work, and my family, you know, all the support that I get out there from y'all, and all the support I get here with my family. So, and thank you all for my wonderful comments on this past, on this Wonderland video. Woohoo! I is in Wonderland, people! <laughs> so it feels good. I know I should not focus on that freaking scale, but you can't help it. You can't help it. So, um, yeah. 
I need to talk about my inches pretty soon because I have lost quite a bit of inches, quite a few inches. So, yeah. All right. I've jibber jabbered along enough. I will see you when we see you. God bless everybody. Bye. You want to say bye, baby? So long, everybody. <laughs> bye bye. Hello, my friends. I just received a package and it's late here and we just checked our mail because we don't always check our mail early in the morning or in the afternoon whenever it gets here. So my husband went outside to go check the mail and I got a package. And I have a feeling I know who's it from. And it says, Dear Connie, thank you so much for all your prayers and support. This is my first chipboard book. You can fill in the blanks if you like. Again, thank you for being such a blessing, love. Belinda. I knew it was you, Belinda. <laughs> oh, oh, look at this. Oh, you and Josie are doing amazing on your chipboards. I haven't even, even done a chipboard book. And I am starting to hang, I'm, you know, eat, Josie's, I'm, I hung it up, I'm going to hang it up on my, well, I have this little clip where I'm hanging them, going to hang them. And this one also, to put my grandbaby's pictures in, so thank you, thank you so much. Look at that. I hope y'all can see all the detail. Look at the butterflies, and I'm assuming this is a nice, it's one of those probably buttons that she had to probably cut the back of it off. Awesome. Awesome. Put some bling on there. Look at that one. Isn't that beautiful? That is gorgeous. Awesome. I've got to start taking more pictures of my grandbabies because they are just growing. Oh, look at that. You did amazing. I'm going to have to take that idea from you, girl. Mm -hmm. I love that. That is just beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. Look at this. Look at that bird. That is a beautiful bird on the paper. I think it's on the paper. I don't think it's a stamp. If it's a stamp, let me know. That's beautiful. Look at that. I've got some pictures right now of my grandbabies that I've got to put up somewhere. This is going to be perfect. Oh, look at this. <gasps> Belinda, did you do this flower? Oh, my goodness. Let me show you that. That is beautiful. And then in the back, that joy. Thank you, thank you so much. I'm going to have to add this video to one of my other videos. So, thank you so much, Belinda. I so appreciate this. I really do. And I will be adding my grandbabies to this chipboard. Thank you, thank you again. Mm -hmm. Bye.